Hi there, how are you? And welcome to Easy Classes. My name is Ramesh, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can solve the site can't be reached problem on your Chrome. If you are unable to browse any website on your browser or Chrome, so you can easily fix. For some kind of errors like DNS probe finished bad configuration error or the site can't be reached and the particular website refused to connect. So such errors you can easily fix. In this video, I'm okay, without further waiting, let's get started. The first method is restart your DNS clients. So go to the windows search bar and type run to open the run command click on that here you need to type services.msc once you done hit on ok here you need to find dns clients for that type d and find dns client here it is then right click on the dns client and hit on refresh so refresh nothing but it will restart so once you have done close the window and restart your device so once you have restarted check whether the problem is solved or not so if not then move to the second method that is change ipv4 dns address for that go to the windows search bar and type control panel and in the best match result you will find control panel app open the app now go to view by options here you have to change large icons to category view now find network and internet option click on that and here you need to click on network and sharing center now find change adapter settings click on that here select which network you are using for example if you are connected with LAN cable then select this option and if you are connected with wireless options like Wi-Fi adapters then select this option right click on the option and select properties here find internet protocol version 4 click on that and again select properties now don't change anything in this first section move to the second section and select use the following dns server addresses so select the second option and here you need to configure the dns server for that type 8 8 8 8 in the alternate dns server type 8 8 4 and followed by 4 so once you have done select validate settings upon exit and then hit ok and close the all windows and a windows network diagnostics window will pop up so once you have done apply this fix now close the all windows and restart your device so once you have restarted your device, check whether the problem is solved or not. If you still having the same problem, then move to the third method that is reset TCP or IP. Click start for the third method. In the windows search bar, type CMD. So you will find command prompt app in the best match result. Right click on the app and select run as administrator and say yes here now you have to follow this step carefully because i'm going to type six different commands simultaneously you have to type all commands one by one to solve this problem okay let's start with first command that is ip config forward slash release and press enter don't worry about these results just keep on typing the commands the second command ip config forward slash all 
and press enter. The third command is ip config forward slash flush dns and press enter. Now we have successfully flushed the dns catch and the fourth command is ip config forward slash renew and press enter the fifth command is optional for you so you can skip or you can continue so no harm to continue this step type net sh space int space ip space set space dns and press enter now finally net sh space win sock space reset and press enter now we have successfully reset the win sock catch lock with the last command so once you have done type exit and press enter to exit the command prompt and close the all windows and restart your device once guys i hope most of our users will get solved this problem by these three methods if you are still having the same problem then move to the next method the fourth method is reset chrome settings now open the chrome browser and type what i am typing here in the search bar follow this carefully type chrome colon forward slash and forward slash double forward slashes then flags once you have done press enter and you will redirect it to this page and don't bother about this warning so just find reset all button so click on the reset all button and close the chrome and restart your windows device once to work this method here i am not clicking reset all because my system has working well okay and friends if you still having the problem then don't worry we have a final method that definitely solve this problem that is reinstall the chrome yes friends i'm not joking go to the control panel and find programs under that you will find uninstall a program click on that and find chrome so uninstall the chrome so once you have uninstalled open any other browser like microsoft edge and download the latest chrome and install on your device that's it guys i hope you enjoyed this video so please like share and comment and easy classes will bring you more solution videos like this if you want to watch them please consider subscribing to our channel we will meet you in the next exciting video like this until then bye bye